In the signs of indirect uh, benefit to Colombian economy as a result of Venezuelan migration, World Bank has said that the arrival of more than a million Venezuelans fleeing a deep social and economic crisis in their country could lead to economic growth in Colombia. But World Bank also said for this, Colombia will have to take the right steps. More than 2 million Venezuelans uh, have emigrated amid flood and medicine shortages and profound political divisions in their country. According to figures from the UN, half have opted to live in Colombia and many have arrived with only what they could carry, providing migrants access to health care, utilities and education will cost Colombia between 0.26% and 0.41% of its gross domestic product this year. The report also added that the country must make medium-term investments to improve those services, but legalizing migrants, some of whom cross the two countries' poorest border without visas or other permissions, will help them find formal jobs and increase tax revenue and consumption. Now, remember, of the 1.03 million Venezuelans living in Colombia, more than half a million have visas or other legal permission, while 240 thousand are in the process of acquiring temporary permission. The remaining uh, 200,000 uh, will stay back because they don't have the authorization to go ahead. Now some 3,000 migrants arrive in Colombia each day and the government says 4 million could be living in the country by 2021, costing Colombia nearly $9 billion.